I don't remember when my mom started painting. I'd guess it was a little after we moved into our new home. Now that she was retired, it was like she was born again. It seemed like all the creativity that had been bottled up for years had finally made its way out. When she began painting, she went all in. She painted every day. It took over our house. The spare room upstairs became her studio. The hallway leading into the kitchen became her gallery. There was at least one of her paintings in every room of our house. Any direction you looked, in any room, you're guaranteed to see a painting. Her art surrounded me. I think being around her art every day made me really begin to ponder as to what I wanted to do in life. Ever since I was a young boy, I was obsessed with film. I would watch my favorites over and over again. Being around my mother, creating art, seeing her happy every day was what made me decide to become a filmmaker. When the day came for me to finally move out of that beautiful home that was covered in her art to pursue my dream of making movies, I told her that I was scared. That maybe my life would go unfulfilled. What she told me after are words I will never forget. She told me that if one wants to truly live a fulfilling life, one only has to do three things before they die. Number one, have a child. To create life is to create love. And love is something the world always needs. Number two, plant a tree. Make your presence known on this earth. And number three, write a book. Tell a story. Tell your story. I often think back to that advice. Is it really that simple? Could life really be as easy as one, two, three? My mother had three children. She planted a pear tree in the backyard years ago. Every summer it overflows baskets with its fruit. And while she still hasn't gotten to writing that book, I don't think she has to, for her story is already being told. It's in her paintings. It's the story of a woman who came from nothing and is making her mark on this world. One child, one tree, and one painting at a time.